There are lots of AI copywriting tools out there. I get it. I've tried almost all of them, but only one of them I keep coming back to because it's actually based on data. You are going to love this. I'm Phil Palin, a brand strategist. Welcome to my channel where I promise practical advice to build your brand. You name the AI copywriting tool and I have tried it, but AnyWord is my tool of choice. AnyWord is a generative AI copywriting platform that empowers marketers to create on-brand content at a scale that converts and drives sales. Yes, they are sponsoring today's video, but I am an actual customer and user and super fan of this platform, and I have been for years, well before the wave of chat GPT and AI tool excitement. Because this tool uses data to create copy that converts, it will improve your copy, and it will score it on your brand and marketing goals using predictive analytics. We'll take a closer look at that right now because it is so cool. You will literally see in a few seconds why I love this tool so much. Sharing my screen, you can use AnyWord for so many different things. Organized here, as you can see, data-driven editor, blog wizard, website targeted messaging. There's truly so much you can do in here. When I click data-driven editor, you'll see things when I go to new document, you'll see things like prompts, ads, landing pages, social media, email, product listing, general writing, and more. I think I've done almost all of these things, but I'll give a quick example by selecting ads. Let's Say for example, you wanna write a Facebook ad and let's say it's gonna promote a service that I offer, which would be a brand audit consultation. Here I can give a quick product description that I could copy from my website or I can write it from scratch. A brand audit is the first step to working together which helps position your brand and make strategic decisions about its future. Okay, so that's just a quick example. If I wanted, I could import this from a web page. So I'll show that quick example. It will go here and I would just select import and it's gonna go and read that page to get some ideas for copy as a starting point. And just like that, I can review the brief. I love actually what it has here. It's taking some copy from that page and I can click approve. And right away, it's gonna generate some ad copy for me. There are some things I can adjust here, which are optional. So it's set to broad audience, but if I wanted to get specific with my customer persona, I could do that here by indicating their pain points, selecting gender, age group. I love how visual this is. I'll click out of that for a second. I can also have talking points, or I can define what formula, what writing formula I want. In this case, it's recommending IDA, attention, interest, desire, action, which I would agree with. That's the right approach for this. I also love the ability to add additional instructions. So let's say, for example, the text length needed to be under 60 characters for Facebook, I could do that. Keep text length under 60 characters. Let's say there's a character limit. You don't need to worry about figuring that after. You can tell this interface up front. So we can select generate. And here it will add some new options up top here. So nothing actually gets deleted. I can keep generating ideas until I'm happy with something. Here's what I love the most about AnyWord, different from other copywriting tools. It's this score that you'll see here on many of the project types here in AnyWord. In this case, we're working on ads. So what this is doing is it's grading the copy variations based on their performance potential. So if I click this, you'll get a few more details. 73 is considered higher than average. That's why I was drawn to this. It's comparing this piece of copy to 953 similar copy variations using its scoring model. And you can read more about this here. I love that it gives me some idea of the audience, who and how they will respond. So in this case, appealing to young and middle-aged adults, it even breaks it down by gender, the tone of voice. Just from what I've written, it's actually breaking down main offerings, benefits, emotions conveyed, and call to action. It's incredible. It will also give you a channel policy. So it'll give you some idea if you could run into problems with this copy on a particular social media platform based on the rules and guidelines. So there, just in a matter of seconds, I was able to write a Facebook ad by giving really minimal detail. And best of all, I'm able to measure this quantitatively by looking at this, the score. Let's shift gears slightly and get you thinking about how to use this tool for your own brand and business. Ads, emails, blog posts, social posts, just to name a few, I'll actually give you some examples. 
There are so many ways that you can use this tool for your business. I bet there are some that you haven't even thought of yet. I love going over here to use cases on the AnyWord website. This is obviously linked in the description below, but hit use cases. And here you'll see what so many people are using AnyWord for. Blog post generator, we'll look at that in a moment. Amazon product description, that might be a great fit for your business. Email copy generator, if you send email blasts like I do. A landing page tool, product description, ad copy, AI writing tool, sentence rewriter, meta description generator. I mean, how awesome to have the help of any word on something like this, really using data from best performing copy, millions of examples. It's gonna do that better than we probably can as humans. Facebook posts, Instagram captions, paraphrasing, the list goes on. There's so, so much here. So check out this page to get ideas on how you can use it. Speaking of use cases, why don't we look at another example, something I often use AnyWord for. I have a podcast and obviously that's useful. SEO, lots of benefits to podcasting. But what I like even more is taking notes during the podcast interview so that we can generate a blog post very quickly full of amazing information just from notes, bullet points like you see on screen. AnyWord can turn this into a full length blog post that's optimized for SEO. So I've selected here the blog wizard before we we're in the data-driven editor, we'll work from the blog wizard, we'll create a new blog post from scratch. So the first thing I'll do is I'll describe what this is about. So in this case, this blog post is all about Clifton strengths and why it's a leading standard of personality assessments. Okay, I might maybe just add another sentence here. You'll learn how to read your results and you'll discover ways to utilize your strengths. So let's click next. Obviously, the more detail you provide here, probably the more accurate the outline will be momentarily. This step is optional, but we can add in some SEO keywords. So target keywords, that's a phrase or a word that best summarizes what the blog post is about. So in this case, it might be what people type into a search engine, for example. In this case, we'll do Clifton Strengths. Press enter to make it a keyword. Here you can do up to two, and then in related, we can add a few more. There you go. I like those. So I'm going to go ahead and select next. So in just a few seconds, it generated some really awesome titles, really engaging titles. I can generate more by clicking this, or I can write my own, but I don't really know why you'd wanna write your own when you have so many amazing options here to choose from. I absolutely love this title. Five reasons why Clifton Strengths is a leading standard for personality assessments. So let's go ahead and select that, and I can click next. Step four is outline suggestions. So here we can break it down into steps, okay? And I think these sections are looking good. I may wanna make a few tweaks, but for the purpose of this example, let's click next. This is absolutely incredible. So I've got a few options of intro paragraphs. Again, I'm looking at that score to give me some idea of how this has the potential to perform. It's really helpful to see this. So I, I like this and I may wanna make some changes later, but you know what? That's a great place to start. Setup is complete. We can continue to the editor. Here we can just keep generating text in each section. This is where I might paste some notes from those notes that we took during the podcast episode. I'll click generate and we'll watch the magic happen. It's incredible how quickly you can generate a blog post in this fashion. Obviously, this is just another example of any word in action. It is fast, it is accurate. I'll finish this blog post after, but you get the picture. So you might be thinking, Phil, why would I wanna use any word instead of ChatGPT or any other copywriting tool? Let's talk about that. Don't get me wrong, ChatGPT is absolutely incredible, particularly GPT-4, the newest model. It impresses me, but when it comes to copywriting, I'm sorry. Yes, ChatGPT can do a lot of things, but it is not better than any word when it comes to copywriting and I will prove it. When I go back to my notes, my podcast notes here, if I'm to select these bullet points, right? The whole point is to use AI to make my life a little bit simpler. So I'm not gonna spend a lot of time editing these. I'm gonna copy the notes and I'm gonna paste them back into ChatGBT with a simple prompt, something like write a blog post from the following bullet points. 
And I get that ChatGPT is really all in the prompt. The power is in the prompt and my prompt can probably be a little bit better, but that's not even the point of what I'm showing you. Certainly, here it goes, writing a blog post. But this, I have to sit here and wait. I also, more importantly, have no idea where it's sourcing, what it's finding. Right, so ChatGPT is great for basic administrative functions, but it's certainly not customized or specialized for this purpose, writing blogs. You might instead think about using this as a research tool before you actually get to the writing stage. When I hop over here to any word, remember this tool trained on millions and millions of examples of good copy is designed for copy. That's why I think this tool is worth the investment and worth your time and energy because you will get the output you want quicker. Be it writing ads, landing page copy, the examples we mentioned earlier, blog posts, the example we looked at together, an example we won't go into detail today but is absolutely awesome is the ability to create targeted messaging using AnyWord and AI for your website. It'll actually change in real time. And best of all, all the copy you've generated here is actually scored, it actually has a number associated with its potential performance. You're not going to get that in ChatGPT and many other copywriting tools on the market. That's why this is my favorite. So that's AnyWord, trained on millions of top performing marketing assets, which you'll notice within seconds of using it. Over 1 million marketers use AnyWord to increase revenue and engagement, seeing an average of 30% in lift in performance. I'm linking to it in the description below so you can give it a whirl for yourself. You can start using AnyWord for free with a seven day trial, no credit card needed. Paid subscriptions, at least at the time of recording this, start at only $24 per Per month, totally worth it. Best of all, my followers get an extra 20% off your first purchase for both the annual and monthly plans using the code that I will show on screen. Just click that link in the description below. If you've got any lingering questions, go ahead and comment below. As I said, I've been using AnyWord for a long time. Happy to elaborate if you run into any challenges. Let's keep the conversation going on down there. I'll respond to those personally. And if you enjoy this video, give it a like. That helps other people discover these videos, which we work hard to create for you. And subscribe for more of my videos on branding, positioning, building, and promoting your brand. Next, I'm sharing a few videos that I think you'll be interested in. I'm Phil Palin. Thanks for watching. Those are coming up next.